number of teens killed in car crashes in Indiana is up higher than any other state in the country. Even more alarming is that it comes as traffic death rates are historically low for that age group. So what's behind the jump? RTV6 reporter Chris Prophet joins us now live with some answers. Chris. And Erica, during the first six months of 2011, three Indiana teenagers died in traffic crashes, but that number jumped to 16 during the same period in 2011. And tonight, there are no clear reasons to why that happened. Ask teenagers about driving distractions, and they know them all. Definitely like texting. You always want to look at your phone. And now that you don't listen to CDs anymore, so you have your iPod plugged in, so you're changing your music, looking down at your phone. According to a new report released on Tuesday, teen driving deaths increased sharply across the nation during the first six months of 2012, and Indiana led the way. Up 13 teen deaths compared to the same period in 2011, according to the Governor's Highway Safety Association. The report looked at 16 and 17-year-old drivers in all 50 states in the District of Columbia. Teens we spoke with are surprised by the findings. I'm pretty shocked, but yet again, seeing my friends drive, we're pretty reckless on the roads. Um, I'm not saying that I'm exempt from that. We all speed, but to see that we have the highest death rate, I feel like we should be, or as teenagers, a little more careful than that. Indiana law makes it illegal to text and drive. However, the study points to the leveling off of state driving programs and that more teens are driving due to an improved economy as factors. Still, inexperience behind the wheel and distracted driving are leading causes for teen traffic fatalities. Reaction time is reduced greatly when uh, they're speeding. So if they have an issue where uh, another vehicle comes in their path or animals crossing the roadway, they have very little time to react. With crashes remaining the leading cause of death among teens, the report is even more alarming considering that deaths among 16 and 17 year old drivers remain at historically low levels. And the report goes on to praise graduated licensing programs in states like Indiana for helping lower the death rate among teens, but also as you heard from those teenagers we spoke with, distracted driving remains a serious problem. Reporting live downtown, Chris Prophet, RTV6.